Okay, YouTube, we're here with the A330 vertical stabilizer and rudder. And you can see it's just it's not painted on the end because the decal didn't wrap. And you've got the servo that's unpainted. Now, normally I would say, oh, no big deal, but especially here where the three would continue through, it, it just, it's really hard to see what it says. And that's compared to this, which is really easy to see. And <clears throat> even though it doesn't come with logo lights, I'll probably add logo lights at some point. So I want it to look really good. So I'm just gonna pause this and I'll show you my progress as I go in each step. Okay guys, we're back. Just give you an update on the steps. Basically I've just taken this, this blue, which is called Blue Angel Blue by Model Masters. And real quick you can see it's it's like T57131. I got this at Hobby Town USA. The number is 1772. And you can see um, it's a very close match. And all I do on the tip is I just continue the dark blue and then the white just sort of works out where it works out. Now I just need to let this set and dry and be patient which is very hard for me. And then I will come back in here and use a high gloss. I do need to, this little spot doesn't want to take the paint. I gotta figure out how to get in there and get that little spot there touched up. So I think I'm gonna have to take a fine brush or just take a Q-tip and cut it in half and see if I can't get it in there. I'm just trying to do it without getting blue paint all over everything so I'll keep you guys in the loop like I always do so just keep watching there'll be more in a little bit hey guys just kinda getting things wrapped up for now the blue looks a lot better at least I think so you can see they've they've just left This area unpainted and so I painted that except for the spot where the A shows through and where the three shows through painted the control horn and all that stuff because once you kind of get a full field of view here it will be a lot better looking and then as you can see the pattern from on top of the wing continues here and here so it looks really nice. And <clears throat> basically when you're, you're looking at the tail of the plane, you don't have that weird white portion. So anyway, here in a well, half an hour, 45 minutes or so, I'll come back down and I'll actually look at uh, doing the rest of my three and my three, which is going to be very tricky. I'll be using this Model Masters enamel. I don't know if that's the number, the 2751 NR25. It's called flat white. You can go off the UPC. And then I have a gloss if that doesn't work out. This one here is just a gloss white. The only reason I would think about maybe doing a gloss white is just because, you know, as you can see, the, the decal is it's glossy. It's got that sheen to it. So I'm going to get everything cleaned up here for now. And uh, here in a little bit, we'll have the rest of it done. Okay, guys, we're back. Working on the A330 tail, vertical stabilizer, and rudder. And as you can clearly see, I've got some paint on there to make the E330 logo more 
to make out. And then um, I challenge you to see the servo, which is pretty hard to see, actually.